Alright, so you can tell from the title, Loot from a Thousand Lucky Implings. I've recently been thinking about updating these a little bit to make them more, um, more efficient with the server, more updated with the server. Uh, basically, the idea to add Lucky Implings came uh, essentially at the last second on the update. Most people don't even know that they exist. So uh, I'll, first off, before I actually open them, I'll explain how you would go about getting them. So first things first, teleport to uh, the Camelot Castle. Uh, whenever you catch the Dragon Impling, you have a 1 in, I think it's 10 now, 1 in 10 chance of spawning a Lucky Impling, and then you catch it. Most people don't even know the Dragon Implings are in here in the first place, so this is a nice little <laughs> tidbit for you. It starts off up here, upon the, uh, whenever like the server gets updated or whatever, it will start off here, and then it will move to a random teleport. It could be anywhere from the training teleports... PvP teleports, the um, skilling teleports, the city teleports. Um, it can't go to PVM or minigame, so don't worry about those two. But it can go in the wilderness, so you might have to check those spots. Um, let me spawn a net and whatnot. Alright, so you need, I believe, 90 to catch the Lucky Impling, 83 to catch Dragon. So you catch a Dragon Impling, and then you would have a 1 in 10 chance of a Lucky Impling spawning right there. The main loot from the Lucky Implings is the Ranger Boots. Ranger Boots are actually pretty, uh, probably should do 14, 14. are pretty uh, rare on the server, not too many people have them, so maybe this video will uh, help encourage people to go hunt these things down. And again, following the feedback from this video, we'll see if any changes need to be made or if they're, they're you know, fine. So I'll put a couple on camera and then we'll just zoom through. So not bad so far, clues. I should definitely add the new pages. There's newer pages now, so... Oh, I forgot you're going to get these Impling Jars, but should we still be fighting 14? Holy Sandals, not bad. Open up a couple more, and then I'll just uh, show off the final loots. Cause I've, oh, Ranger Boots. See, that's not really... I mean, the rates on it, I think, from what I... If I remember correctly, it's like around 1 in 50. So it's not bad. I think you definitely need to add the new pages. I'm thinking about uh, updating the uh, items, uh, sort of to, to include more um, just the diverse things. Because I think I'm, I'm gonna, I think we're probably gonna get a lot of duplicates, but that's fine. Like I said, this this idea came together like in 20 minutes. The code worked out, per everything worked out perfectly. I didn't have to test it much or anything like that. So yeah, I think originally it was one in 25, but I don't. I, I hunted it a fair bit on my legit account, and I, I was never able to get a single spawn, so I, I upped the limit a little bit. All right, so I'm gonna open up the rest of these, and we'll see loot. All right, so we have the loot from a thousand lucky implings. So if you notice, we only lost about 70 jars, so the, the the chance you have of losing a jar is really not that high. If you're wondering where these two mystery boxes came from, apparently you can actually get the mystery boxes while um, looting jars, not just catching implings. If I, can, I don't know. If one of those messages will still show up. Uh, I mean, it'll definitely stand out because it's blue. Nope, it's, it hasn't happened. I only got got it twice. It is a 1 in 1700 chance of getting a mystery box, but I, I, I was under the impression it was only from actually catching the impling. Apparently, it is from the uh, looting of the uh, jar as well. So, first thing to note, we actually got more ranger boots than we did the other pairs of boots. All of these items... I believe are on an equal weight, so um, that's kind of why they're all very similar. But uh, yeah, that was interesting to note. Also got the most uh, sleeping caps. That's the that's the highest amount. Uh, tons of pages. Um, I thought all pages were in it, but apparently just Zami. So that's fun. Uh, master clues are in here, and I got 58 of those more than any other clue. So that's pretty interesting. And then I guess we'll open up these two mystery boxes as well. So yeah, the main thing I wanted to to sort of talk about is. Should we make any changes? Do you think this loot is fine? Should we add things? Remove things? I think just simple stuff like adding the rest of the pages, uh, maybe adding more useful clue items, some that, that go in those sets and whatnot. Any changes I make um, in terms of adding new items would make Ranger Boots more rare. So let me know what you think about all of that. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed and see you tomorrow.